Good morning, day six of lockdown. This is Mr. Bradley and I'm going to be showing you how to add Purple Mash to your Android device. We've decided that Purple Mash would be the appropriate tool to use in this difficult time. Purple Mash is going to be the primary tool for the grade 1s to 4s. We're going to use it to do our teaching and learning. The approach you're going to use if you've got an Apple device will be somewhat different. I'll try to cover that as well. We're going to use the address shown in this quick login shortcut. We're going to place that in our home screen. This will be provided to you via the comment section. Just copy and paste that into your browser. There we go. I've just been taken through to where I would have to enter my username and password. Now, most learners will know their username and password. You can enter that if you have this. Otherwise, you should see the whole list of classes making up our school. You can just enter your username and password and then follow as I show you how to put the actual Purple Mash link on your home screen of your Android device. I'm just putting in my email over there, but I don't want you to see my password, so I'm going to block out some of that. Press on the smiley face, that means OK, and off we go to the Purple Mash site. Here we are loading, and you can see Purple Mash has just opened, and there we in Purple Mash. We could have just logged in with guest mode and used Purple Mash, but we want to assign work and we want to work properly and check up on our work and make sure that it's done properly. So that's why we'd use this approach. I've logged in and so I now want to place Purple Mash on my home screen so that I get easy access. So let me show you how to do that. I've gone into the internet using Chrome. That's my browser. You'll find that there's three little dots on the top right hand side. Press the three little dots and you'll see that a menu comes down. We just need to choose the appropriate option to bookmark or place an icon on our home screen to access Purple Mash from here. You can see that the Add to Home screen is the fourth from the bottom. So that's the one that I'm going to be choosing because I want to add a link to Purple Mash on my home screen of, of my device. I am using an old Telefunken that is running Android 5.1. Pressing that Add button will just add Purple Mash to my home screen. That's exactly what I want to do. So it's the Add button over there. We want all children to get easy access, and that's the way to do it. It's merely just pressing a button. How did we do that? We got to the three little dots in the top right-hand side, and on this menu we chose Add to Home Screen. And that button would allow us to get into Purple Mash it all will look like this when we get into Purple Mash. With an Apple device, I think that you're not going to have three little dots, but a square with a little plus sign, if I remember correctly. And you'd be using the browser called Safari. I've just closed the browser, so I want to see what happens here. Just loading up. Let's see. Ah, oh, there we go. And I've got a Purple Mash login icon over there. Click on it, and let's see how it opens. Taking a while to open. You can see I've got a little icon there. I'm using Mobazine, which is to record my screen for you guys. Now I should get to the login page and the password section should already be filled and that'll allow me to go straight into Purple Mesh. There we go. And you can see it's already over here. All I have to do is press login. You should be able to easily get into Purple Mesh like this. And there is a way of in ensuring that your password is saved and that eventually you don't need to go through the login page. You'll go directly into Purple Mash and will be able to interact straight away. I hope this helps you and you find that there's no problems doing this. Actually pretty easy. All you do is click on the three little dots on the top right hand side. Choose the option to add it to your home screen. See the add to home screen dialog box and you just press the add button and that'll place it on your device. You'll see the Purple Mash icon on your device. Here I've got a Telefunken running Android 5.1. From this point, it's as simple as just clicking on the Purple Mash shortcut. Remember that Purple Mash runs on all devices, and our children are very familiar with the interface, so we shouldn't have any problems with that. There are lots of other approaches which we won't go into at this point. 
Many of them will become part of our practice as we interact in a new way. A big thank you for watching this video. Stay safe and you're more than welcome to contact me if you have any questions or problems.